It's um the awesome creationist here. Uh, I have several questions for you, and please answer these questions. Have you ever lied before? Have you ever blasphemed God's name before? Have you ever stolen anything, no matter what the value it was? Jesus said, Whoever looks upon a woman to lust after her has committed adultery with her already in his heart. Have you ever looked at another person of the opposite gender with lust? Have you ever broken the Sabbath before? If you answered yes to all of these questions, then you have admitted to lying, blaspheming, stealing, lusting, and breaking the Sabbath. You have to face God on Judgment Day. Are you going to heaven or hell? If you die in your sins, then you will end up in hell where there is weeping and wailing and gnashing of teeth. To go to heaven, you must repent of your sins and put your trust in Jesus Christ. If you repent of your sins and put your trust in Jesus Christ, then you will become saved and you will get everlasting life in heaven. Jesus Christ died on the cross for your sins. God will forgive you of your sins. It would also be a great idea to read the Holy Bible daily. The Bible says today is the day of your salvation. Repentance is urgent because you do not know when you're going to die. I am not using fear tactics, it's just straight facts. You need to truly repent and put your trust in Jesus Christ to become saved. Please think about this. Well, hello everyone. Okay, so today I will be exposing a cult known as Paganism. Uh, okay, so Paganism is an evil cult that has many evil practices, and obviously, evil practices are sinful. Paganism also has evil practices that are witchcraft, and paganism is obviously polytheistic and idolatrous. Let's take a look at scripture. Now the works of the flesh are evident. Sexual immorality, impurity, sensu sensuality, idolatry, sorcery, enmity, strife, jealousy, fits of anger, rivalries, dissensions, divisions, envy, drunkenness, orgies, and things like these, I warn you as I warned you before that those who do such things will not inherit the kingdom of God. Galatians 5 verses 19 through 21 ESV Sorcery is witchcraft and is a work of the flesh, and idolatry is a work of the flesh as well. Obviously, idolatry and witchcraft are both sins. We should not practice witchcraft at all, since witchcraft is very evil and creepy, and witchcraft is a sin. Well, paganism is a satanic cult that is completely worthless, and the pagan practices are also completely evil and worthless. Paganism is leading many people into hell with their idolatry and witchcraft, and many other worthless evil practices Witchcraft is completely worthless. We should not practice in any evil practices at all, since evil practices are a sin. Oh, and witchcraft is a sin, as well. The Bible warns against evil practices and, idol uh, and idolatry and witchcraft. Let's take a look at scripture. But as for the cowardly, the faithless, the detestable, as for murderers, the sexually immoral, sorcerers, idolaters, and all liars, their portion will be in the lake that burns with fire and sulfur, which is the second death. Revelations, oh, Revelation 21 verse 8 ESV Idolatry is a sin, sorcery is witchcraft, and witchcraft is a sin. The Bible warns that idolaters and sorcerers will not inherit the kingdom of God. In conclusion, paganism is a satanic cult that is completely worthless. Pagan practices are evil, and paganism also has witchcraft. 
and paganism is idolatrous. Okay, so I hope you are warned that paganism is a dangerous cult. Alright, right, anyways, have a nice day. Please subscribe to my channel. Goodbye.